Hey everyone, and welcome back to Crypto Whiteboard 101, the series in which I answer your most important questions about cryptocurrencies in less than two minutes. And today we're answering the question, what is Bitcoin dominance and what is the significance of it? Now, Bitcoin dominance is simply a ratio of Bitcoin's market cap to the market cap of the cryptocurrency market in general. So we're comparing Bitcoin to altcoins. And when we say altcoins, that just means a coin that is not Bitcoin. It doesn't mean it's a good coin or a bad coin. It's just not Bitcoin. Bitcoin dominance is one of the most used statistics that you will find in the cryptocurrency world. It's listed right on CoinGecko's main page right there beside the ETH gas price. So very important. But what does it actually mean? Now, obviously, we said it measures the relative market cap of Bitcoin compared to other cryptos, but it has a little bit deeper meaning as well. Cryptocurrencies are generally considered to be volatile assets. However, among these volatile assets, Bitcoin is sometimes seen as relatively more stable and relatively more predictable. So as Bitcoin dominance increases, that means more people are preferring Bitcoin to some of these other altcoins. So it can be kind of thought of as a fear and greed index of sorts. Changes in Bitcoin dominance, things that will increase dominance are an increase in the price of Bitcoin, more Bitcoin being issued, decrease in the price of altcoins, or a decrease in the number of altcoins. Things that would decrease Bitcoin's dominance are obviously the inverse of all of these things. Now, although dominance is relatively easy to understand, there are some issues with it. So, for example, high coins with a low liquidity but a high price can throw off the market cap valuations a little bit depending on how they are valued. Secondly, there's a bit of a vague interpretation. We know that dominance tells us the relative ratio of Bitcoin's uh, market cap to the cryptocurrency market in general, but what does that actually mean? Yeah, it might tell us that people prefer safety and security of Bitcoin to profit and risk of altcoins, but it doesn't really tell us where the price is going or things like that. So um, it's an important figure to be aware of, but at the same time, it's just one component of understanding the broader cryptocurrency market. I hope you all found this video useful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.